What's going on guys? It's your boy and the arts and today uh, This is not gonna be a drone video. I am going to uh, talk about the uh, Samsung book Right Samsung book uh, tablets Right. I absolutely love these products. So I have I've actually had the Samsung book uh, three, right? Samsung Book Three, but this also works if you have a Samsung. If you want to get the Samsung Book Two, works uh, works as well. Whether well, if it's the 13 inch or the or the 15 inch or 16 inch, whichever one. And I'm gonna show you guys. You know, taking notes on this device is absolutely beautiful, right? And uh, so this, the Samsung tablets usually come with two two. Uh, note taking applications which is the samsung notes and the uh the note self and uh, we're gonna start with my favorite here which is samsung notes and the way it works uh we're gonna go back here right so as you can see here i actually have a whole bunch of notes these are this is for a story i wrote it's got a whole bunch of notes here for a story i wrote because uh, i want to like make a manga japanese manga one day a bunch of notes and i'm gonna open uh actually let me Show you a peek right so this is some notes i took right and um it's all in this is like what like five pages worth of notes on this one right so there's five pages worth of notes and uh some of you might, might be saying okay well can i use it uh can i use it like vertically and i'm gonna show you how to use it vertically um because it, it's um because this tablet was meant to use mainly horizontally um i think it's uh it's a little too big to like you know find it find comfort like in hor hor uh, vertically but I'll show you so um, hold on, let's go back so Samsung notes we're gonna use a brand new one so here we have an empty right an empty sheet it's got no it's got notebook style paper if you guys can see it if it's not too much glare but it's got notebook style paper and also you can actually change the template where is it there is a way to change this, to change the style. You can actually change page template. Right, so you can use, you can have like a gridded type. You guys can see that, right? You guys can see that is gridded. It's just grid, like if you're going to school and you're, I don't know, do math or geometry or something like that. Uh, there's also other options, like you can use this list this is a checklist right here right you can see it that is a checklist right and um, the thing is what else? Dang it. yeah there's a lot, of, like a lot of options here but we're gonna go ahead and use the uh, notebook paper Right, this is notebook paper template. All right, so in order to use this, uh, we got our pencil and pen options here. There's also brushes, inks. There's a brush here. Let me try to use the red ink. There's a brush here. And we use the eraser, it just kind of erases the whole thing, right? Um, so we're going to use the pencil. I'm going to say in the arts. Use the ink, say, YouTube channel. We color it in. Right, so this is this application. It's not for drawing, obviously, but I'm just showing you guys. And we use, it's going to use the eraser. It's going to erase the whole thing, right? This is actually pretty fun. I actually like this device. I like note taking here. This is the Samsung Notes. And uh, like I show you, uh, you can change the type of, um, you can change how it looks, you can change the background color, whether you can use grids, notebook, paper, whatever, right? So many ways to use it. And uh, these are my pages, like I said. And now the second uh, second application for note taking is called Note Self for Sa of Samsung. It's actually a pretty good one, although I do th I do still think that Samsung Notes is better. Right, so right uh, in the parts. You guys can see that, right? 
And also, let me show you what it's like to use it uh, horizontally. Here are my uh, little stand. Not horizontally. Uh, vertically. Because this is a 15-inch tablet, right? It's a 15-inch tablet. It takes up a lot of space. See? Right, Andy Arts. You can see the whole sheet of paper here. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and use the eraser. Eraser. The eraser, right? Get the pen again. I should use a different color. The color is red. My YouTube channel. Right, YouTube. Or you could take, let's say, uh, math two plus. It's great for note taking. Again, like I said, uh, this has a lot of. Uh, this also has some templates. Paper template. I think it's got a little more options than. Uh, oh, it's got a to-do list here. Yeah. So let me erase this. It's got a to-do list. Look at that. Task appointments. Right, page. Uh, got a grid. If you're like studying to be an engineer or something, right? Uh, what else does it have? It's got a. Um, got some type of grainy. Oh, it's got a hexagon paper. Wow, this is interesting. Hold on. This is interesting. So you can also use it to like measure things, I guess. I'm having I'm kind of having fun with this right now. <laughs> right, it's got a, like a hexagon type of paper. I don't know if you guys can see that, right? If you guys can see that. So yeah, this is, um. so you can actually use it this way, you know, grab it like this, right? This is, again, it's a 15 inch tablet. Maybe you have the 13 inch, which is a little more comfortable to grab. And grab it, take it to school. But really, it's better to, but for, for this size, better to use it like this, right? Better to use it this way. So yeah, I mean, I think this is an overall. Uh, it's great for note taking. I've already, I've already showed you guys how I use it drawing. I use, I use Clip Studio. Let me open one of my projects. Yeah, I use Clip Studio. Uh, on this, on the Samsung book, Samsung Galaxy book, right? This is Clip Studio, and it, why is this so bright? I'm sorry about the lighting, guys. Uh, this has like, it's like really bright. I don't know why it, it shows it this way. But uh, let me show you if I can lower the brightness a little bit. There you go. Hopefully you guys can see that. Yeah, so it was like really bright. But um, uh, anyways, uh, that this is writing and note taking with uh, the Samsung Galaxy Book 360, right? Again, this is a 360 device because you can, you know, it's got the keyboard is actually on the back, right? So the keyboard is on the back, right? You can fold it bring it back to normal all right so um i hope you guys actually enjoy this maybe if you're thinking about buying this device this was like a helpful you know buying guide for that hopefully i'll help you make a buying decision and if you're an artist like myself you can use it for drawing painting your you know your characters landscapes whatever this is this also very professional device because you can take it on the go let's say if you travel a lot this is great for traveling uh, you can take it wherever you go um, and you know, 
it, it actually charges up pretty fast. Now, uh, I will not use this for video editing. I will use this for drawing, watching videos, doing homework, writing tasks, you know, business stuff. I would not use it for video editing. I will use a, a, a computer that's a little more powerful, designed for, for editing videos. Uh, but aside from that, for drawing and other stuff, this is absolutely great. As far as gaming, I don't know if you can game on this. Uh, maybe I, I wouldn't I wouldn't play like God of War, right? I would not play God of War on this laptop. But I would play like smaller games, kind of like you know like triple uh, A games. No, no, excuse me, not triple A, double A games like Hi-Fi Rush, like a Pokemon, like a, something that doesn't use a lot of energy. Like if you're gonna play Hogwarts Legacy on this device, I do not recommend it because that game is very graphics heavy. <laughs> Hogwarts Legacy is a very, uh, it's a very graphics uh, heavy game. So it really all depends on the game. If you're gonna play Mega Man on this, I I, I recommend it. Uh, other than that, this is great. An overall great device. You can fold it. You use it as a laptop. You use it as a drawing tablet. It is a two-in-one. It's absolutely great for writing and taking notes, uh, drawing and gaming. Uh, so uh, that's it for this uh, video. Uh, make sure to give it a like. Comment below. Comment below. Tell me what you think, guys. You know and subscribe to the channel subscribe subscribe hit the notification bell for future videos i make videos about drawing I make videos about the uh, art i make videos on tech reviews you know technology and um that is it bye bye subscribe